Art Fair Confidential, the Be in the Know podcast for the art curious. Join the creators of Art Expo New York and Spectrum Miami Art Fairs as they delve into the passions of art collectors, the creative spirit of artists, the how-tos of a successful art business, and the importance of art in today's world with interviews, discussions, and collaborations. Sponsored by Art Business News. So first I want to say, today's a day of celebration because the moment that we stepped in to Spectrum Miami, we felt welcome when we came. Our installation process was simple and easy. I love the lighting. Because my work is so intricate, it's not something that you're going to take in your first glance. It's really a look, look again, and look some more. So the magnifying glasses that I have allow you to be curious. People walk by, they see them, they feel like, why are those magnifying glasses there? Can I touch them? Of course you can, I encourage everyone to. And as you get closer into one of my images, you'll see that they're composed of handwritten calligraphy. And it becomes an intimate moment where you're now present with yourself you're taking a moment to really absorb what you're looking at and interacting with. And for me, that's when my art truly comes alive. My style of art, it's called micrography. It's actually a very old technique from the seventh century. And it's something that I've been looking and working at for the last 30 years, really figuring out how to make it truly my own. And I love that I can play with the length of a letter or the thickness of a pen and really capture shadow, feeling, and texture. Let me tell you, the first night I was blown away. For the very first time, I actually had people in line waiting to get a magnifying glass so that they could have a moment to participate with the work. And that's a feeling you never forget. It has truly been unbelievable. So I take it you enjoy having, uh, doing these types of shows, getting people uh, up in front? coming to you one on or straight direct direct right so how would you say you describe this event compared to maybe others or your other experiences this event is really about what you put into it is what you get out of it i enjoy meeting and listening to everyone's stories it's a great opportunity to network when you're in the journey of an artist it is not just about did i sell it's about the relationships that you build. It's also the other artists to have camaraderie and to meet other creatives and really encourage one another. And then the really beautiful icing on the cake is yeah, you do get sales. And yeah, you do get to make more professional relationships that help to build a sustainable art career. I hope that everyone will take a moment to just do a little Google search and look up my name, Miklina, M-E-C-L-I-N-A, and you'll find more of my work and get to go on the journey with me as we continue to create beautiful stories. Listen to more of the Art Fair Confidential podcasts at redwoodartgroup.com forward slash podcasts. And we'd love to hear your feedback as well as suggestions for new topics. Just drop us a note at info at redwoodartgroup.com or click on the comments box at the bottom of the podcast website page. Remember to stay in the know. Join us next time for more Art Fair Confidential.